the Ahmedabad Mumbai High Speed Rail is India's first high speed rail project, connecting Mumbai and Ahmedabad. It spans 508 km with 12 stations, and the bullet train will travel at 320 km per hour, completing the journey in 2 hours and 7 minutes. Its successful completion will pave the way for India's high speed rail network, stimulating economic growth, satellite town development, and increasing the country's GDP rate. The project will also benefit the Indian construction industry and promote the use of new technologies, aligning with the Make in India objective. The precast yard for full span girder fabrication shall consist of mainly mold assembly area, girder stacking area, rebar jig location, batching plant, ready made steel plant. Plants and Machinery Workshop To prepare the mold assembly bed Compact the soil beneath the bed to 90% compaction and add necessary ground improvement layer on top. Cast a 100mm PCC leveling course above the compacted soil. Construct an RCC bed for the outer mold on top of the PCC leveling course. Prepare pedestal and foundation for the inner form parking area, maintaining correct levels for easy entry and exit. Assembly of formwork for girder casting involves fixing prefabricated mold components, such as outer and inner forms, at specific locations. The alignment of the mold is checked meticulously to ensure proper line and level. Fixing and assembly of rebar cage. The rebar cage shall be assembled in the rebar jig. In 40m span about 42 metric tons steel is used. Shifting and placement of pre-assembled reinforcement cage. The reinforcement cage shall be lifted by a straddle carrier slash crane using a lifting truss having multiple lifting points. After positioning the reinforcement cage, check its alignment. Install and lock bulkheads on both sides. Fit roller supports on PVC sleeves for smooth movement of the inner form. Verify alignment of the reinforcement cage after fixing the inner form. The girders will be constructed using a single pour method, with each layer of concrete not exceeding 300 mm thickness. Chilled water will be used to maintain the pouring temperature as per specifications. Approximately 390 cubic meters of concrete is required for a 40m full span girder. The DLT 1100 straddle carrier is a crucial component in the Mumbai to Ahmedabad high speed railway project. It can handle box girders with spans from 30m to 40m, weighing up to 1,100 tons. The equipment includes the main beam, leg, traveling mechanism, winch trolley, electrical system, and hydraulic system. It is used to lift and transport box girders in the stacking yard. The bridge gantry equipment consists of two MG550 gantries that work together to lift and transfer a box girder at various positions. The gantries, A and B, operate jointly to handle tasks like lifting, placing, and installing the girder. Each gantry has a main beam, two legs, and four traveling mechanisms. The transverse movement is achieved through a winch trolley. The LG launcher features a box girder structure as its main frame, with a winch trolley for longitudinal movement. The trolley is also capable of moving transversely, providing flexibility and versatility to the launcher's operations. The girder transporter is a specialized vehicle used to transport box girders on bridge construction sites. It is designed to transfer box girders weighing up to 1,100 metric tons and spans of 30-40m. The transporter, such as the DCY-1100, consists of various components like the frame, suspension assembly, power system, and girder carrying system.
The erection and installation methodology for the project involves several steps. 1. The girder is shifted from the casting bed to the stacking bed using a straddle carrier. 2. A bridge gantry is then used to place the girder on top of the gantry transporter. 3. The gantry transporter moves over the erected span and carries the new span to be erected to the launching girder. 4. The launching girder finally erects the span and then auto-launches to the next pier. Additionally, the preparation of the pier cap includes the installation of bearings and stoppers. 5. The casting and erecting of full-span pre-stressed box girders is the most efficient method for executing superstructure works in large projects like the high-speed rail project. It reduces construction time and ensures better quality. The entire box girder is cast in one go, resulting in a superior finish. Maintenance of the superstructure's geometry is easier, and casting can continue while substructure work progresses, reducing project execution time. Compared to segmental superstructures, full-span girder casting and erection require less time and have fewer critical activities, minimizing the chances of accidents. Although specialized machinery is needed, the benefits outweigh the capital cost. In time-sensitive projects that demand excellent quality and aesthetics, the full-span erection method is the best choice.